Hello, hello. I am back for another plan with me. It is week two in January and I am on week two with my planner. Look, you're doing a great job, Stephanie. Great. I feel like everything should be celebrated. It's it's worth it. Um, I think I showed you guys this last video, the map that I had gotten to mark all year where my customers, you fabulous people have ordered. And this is January. So, and I still have, and I have to add these. Um, I went ahead and ordered one for each month because then I decided how fun would it be just to see each month. Even if I don't fill it up, like hopefully I'll have a filled up one by the end of the year, like between all 12 months. But I thought that would be kind of cool. So I was like, eh, why not? Um, so uh, I did show this last week. Sammy Doodle Designs, her wacky holidays. Fantastic. Um, this is how last week ended up. So, um finished doing all that and then we were pen testing in my Facebook group and we were trying to see how it looked on planner paper because I was doing it in a notebook um, and that was a brush letter pen that um, I did not like at all and that okay so this is cool I've done some hand lettering videos um, on this channel but it's mainly planning um, but I got these gel pens from the Dollar General uh, and they uh, the ring lights putting a little bit of a glare. Sorry. Um, they were $5 and 50 cents and it has all of these colors in it and they are, f oops, sorry. I just shimmied the camera. They are fabulous. They are, they write so smooth. They write as smooth as the Uniball, um, Signo ones. I mean, I was shocked and they were really inexpensive. That brand, um, one of the people in my Facebook group looked it up and you can get it on um, Amazon, Michaels, um, where else did they say? Walmart, I think was the other one, maybe. So you can find them in other places. I bet they're probably definitely cheapest at the Dollar General, of course, but you know. Um, okay, so, but yeah, I think I'm gonna be using one in my planner spread this week. Um, more than likely I'll use the black one just so it will stand out. Um, I've had this kit from Avalon and Ninth for, I don't even, I couldn't even tell you how long, but I thought that it was really pretty and it was a great start to the new year. Um, and so I, I had to cut off the top because it was in a different album and it didn't fit. One of those ones from Simply Gilded. Um, but yeah, so I can't even begin to tell you how long um, I've had this. I know over a year. So we're gonna use that one. And then I just got her January sub in the mail. So we're gonna use this because I thought the oranges and the yellows and even the blues go really well in this. And then we're gonna incorporate, oops, the blues and yellows from the September monthly spun, uh, monthly bundle, splash bundle from Chaz over at Shameless. And then I'm gonna pull in these green scallops from Kelly Shiner James, and maybe even some of these from Beyond uh, Paper Flowers. So I'll probably do the combo because that matches and it will pull in these. So yeah, we're just gonna use them both. Use all the pretty things. Uh, dun, 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 dun. all right, so let me get all this together. Yep, need those first. Okay, okay, all right. Anyways, yeah, so I'm gonna set those right there so they're in front of me. And I got had tweezers, I think we're doing okay. I don't need any white out stuff. Okay, we're rocking and rolling, rock and rolling. Today is Monday, January 9th. It is Georgia. I'm drinking a monster drink. It's already been that kind of morning. Um, national champion game tonight. I am so excited. I cannot wait um, for this. I am so ready. It will be our second year in a row that uh, we're at the championship game. My fingers aren't working. Um, I think it's been since like 2011 or 2012. I can't remember since, uh, we're gonna rotate. We're gonna make this super freaking colorful. Um, since a team has done back-to-back -back championships, and of course that was Alabama uh, that did that 
Um, and I thought Alabama would have had more, but when I pulled up their stats, they had like, they had lost to Clemson in between some years, and it had been some time since it was a back to back championship win. So I was like, oh, well, that's interesting. I mean, it just seems like Alabama always wins everything. Um, except for this year, like, sorry for my Alabama fans out there. Like, how you doing? I'm checking in. Are you okay? <laughs> um, but, you know, I mean, that's just how it goes. So, um, one thing's for certain, though. Um, you know who won't be in the championship game? Carolina. Because they suck. Sorry for all my Carolina fans out there. I live in Columbia, South Carolina, or near Columbia, South Carolina. I mean, close enough that that's where I worked when I worked my corporate job. Um, and every day during football season, Monday through Friday at 12 and 5, I had to listen to the damn Rooster Crow for, because they're the Carolina Gamecocks. And let me tell you, when you're a Georgia fan, it makes you want to um, be a little murdery. So, yeah, was not, like, in my, you know, I was always walking out the door at 5 o'clock to go home, and let's just say, it was not well appreciated, so. <laughs> but, anyways, I, I, I probably should have done it like that so you could see more of the scallop, but then I wanted to see the bottom of the scallop, you know what, it don't matter. Uh, but yeah, so, uh, that is what's going on here at the Bant's house tonight. I am going to do some work as quick as possible and I am going to go downstairs and as quick as possible. I do, I mean, I make my own schedule. I could literally not do the work. Um, I've got some things that I've got to knock off my plate and then I'm going to bust ass downstairs and get my Christmas decorations put away because I have not yet, surely because uh, I've been lazy. Um, and I put them up a little bit late. I like to put them up the week after, the week end of Thanksgiving because in my mind, if I'm gonna go through all this trouble of putting them up, I wanna look at them for a really long time. So I leave them up let's, um, for a while. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So, oh, I'm gonna need these. Where is, but yeah. So, uh, I just, we were supposed to take them down this weekend and Saturday was really busy. Russ was doing a bunch of projects around the house. And um, yesterday we went out to breakfast and then we went to, um, we ran some errands and stuff and I was just like, and then I worked and then I, didn't, I just didn't want to. <laughs> I didn't want to do it. You can't make me. Uh, so, but yeah, let's see. Let's add some yellow. Oh, okay. Let's add some. Sh sh I don't know where that song is coming from in my head. Uh, my hands. I swear I'm getting arthritis in my hands or something. They just don't want to work half the time. Uh, let's see here. So we've got some, here we go. I thought, yeah, this one is a big box. So that needs to go. Those new boxes need to go together. So let's do this one. Mm -hmm. Ooh, love. So I've got uh, 80s. What is this channel? It's like 80s love ballads or something on in the background. I don't know if you guys can hear it. I don't know if YouTube is going to take this down if you can hear it. Um, I meant to pause it and I forgot. Oh, wait, here we go for my dinners. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cool. That's going to be pretty. I think I'm going to need a white, my white pen on this one though. Um, let's see. I don't use the washi at the bottom because I go all the way down. All right. Let's rock and roll guys. Um, Come on, fingers, get your life together. So, um, let's see here, what else is going on around here? Um, Sadie is still rocking and rolling. Um, she uh, is doing okay. I mean, I need to call the vet because I am kind of worried about her breathing and stuff. Uh, she doesn't seem I don't know, it just seems like she's not getting a lot of air, possibly. I don't know. Um, oh, you know what? 
no, let me do this. Um, so I'm a little concerned. Um, I mean, she's eating and drinking just fine. It's just the breathing with her snot, you know, it just sounds so bad. Um, so I might, um, call the vet and see. I mean, the only thing that we could do would be more x-rays and more x-rays, um, will, I mean, just to see if, like, guess if the tumor is getting bigger. Uh, that's the only thing that I can think of that they would do. So, I don't know. I mean, it just sounds bad, you know? It just sounds bad. I'm gonna do this big one like this. So, I don't know, we'll see. Um, I'm gonna call them and see what they think. Um, I mean, since she is eating and drinking just fine, I can't imagine, you know, it just, I don't know. I'm just babbling at this point because I'm trying to concentrate on what I'm doing and that never works out well. And then I'm also trying to, um, peel stickers off of a piece of paper and talk. And I just, I'm not very good at multitasking. <laughs> you can't tell. Um, well, you know what? Let me, I think I'm gonna, let me do some yellow right here instead. These circles are fun. So, I think maybe this music in the background is distracting also. Anyways. But, that's what is uh, going on around here. Um, nothing truly exciting. I was going to do this positive vibes one. Hmm. Huh. Okay. We'll set that aside and see. That's a really big circle under there. Uh. I'm just gonna. I know, um, Amy from Adorably Amy Designs commented that I should get some undo. I think I've talked about this before. I'm petrified of undo. I don't know how you guys use it. You're pouring liquid on your planner, so it scares the crap out of me. Uh, so I'm not really quite sure what you're thinking. Uh, wait, hold on. I got washi for this. So, <laughs> really not quite sure what you're thinking. It makes me nervous when you guys do that. But I know from a lot of people that they love it and um, do like literally pour it all over their planner. So if you use undo, let me know. Um, oh yeah, that's right. So last week the subscription launched and it went fabulous. I love you guys for that. Uh, I hit my high goal on day two. Today is the ninth and we still have six more days um, to sign up. I wanted to try and catch everybody's pay period. Um, and it's set to renew on the 5th of each month, but if you need it on another day, you can message me because I can change it to whatever we want. It doesn't tell us what to do. <laughs> so yeah, definitely let me know, uh, if, but it is set to renew the 5th because I just figured that would catch the end of the year or end of the month and beginning of the month pay periods. Um, so I'm going to do yellow right here. Um, I'm going to do this little squiggly line on this side, but hold on, I'm going to do it like this. Uh, so yeah, so subscriptions and those ship out on the 25th. That way after it closes, it gives me plenty of time to, um, print and cut everything we need and then, um, it gives me plenty of time to get my foil sheets done that because those come from somebody else and then it gives um, that way I can 
still design and fill other orders. Um, there was a couple of you that ordered with your sub. So that stuff all waits if you order with your sub. It's a lot easier if you don't order with your sub, but is the first time for everything this, for everybody learning this month. So um, just FYI. Uh, Woo, that paper is ripping. No, it's not. Yes, it is. It is a little bit, but it's okay. Because we're going to put it right back down in the same spot. <sighs> we just had to get that over. There we go. I can hear everybody cringing. <laughs> there we go. Winning. All right. Done, done, done. I feel like this is empty. You know what I can always... More cowbell. <laughs> More splashes. Isn't it the same thing? <laughs> there we go. Right, I'll put something right there. I'm like, yeah, this still looks empty. Um, oh, you know what? A snark always works. What should we put for Wednesday? Um, oh, you know what? Wednesday is not... Okay, we can put this. Because it is going to be a weird mood kind of day. I have a funeral to go to on Wednesday. So, last week pretty much sucked big donkey butt. Because, um, um, on Tuesday I found out that I had lost a friend. On Friday found out we had lost a family friend. Like, if there was ever a week that I was so done, it was last week. Definitely last week. All right. Um, we are going to, yep, yep, yep. No, wait, that's today. What the hell? Because I'm used to f football being on Saturday because, you know, I'm so, I feel like my brain is just mush lately. Anybody else feel like that? Just mush. Let's do a baby one. Um... I probably should drink more of that monster drink is what I should do. All right. Let me, oh, we are playing TCU at 8 p.m. in L.A. What? Okay. Can, I don't know if anybody can. I don't know if you can see that glitter. These are the these are the dollar store pins. Yeah, we're gonna do it like that. These are the dollar store pins, or Dollar General pins. Okay, there we go. Ta da! Um, oh, we need our. Let's see here. It's been such a long time since I got, yep, she does. Excellent. Let's see here. Let's throw in some more blue. Oh, Elvis is down there raising cane, barbally barking at the air, um, or a leaf blowing in the wind. Who knows? Oh, I hear keyboards going at it too, which means that the neighbors are either walking down and putting their mail in the mailbox, checking their mail from Saturday, or, you know, again, a leaf is blowing in the wind. Okay, so we got that. Oh, you know what? That's what I'm gonna do too. How about This is, this is National Pizza Week. Did you guys know that? Uh, the last one was so big, it covered up everything. Let's just throw this right here. I kind of want it to be seen though, you know? Let's see here. I guess you can see it right there. Okay, we're gonna, cause it kind of just fits right there really nicely. All right, National Pizza Week. All right, that, get that out of the way. 
Um, let's do green scallops. Hey, Sugarfoot. What are your brothers out there doing? Oh my God, I don't know if y'all can hear that or not. That's her, that's how she breathes. Um, so now you can see why I am a little bit. Where, I mean, she's been like that for a while and she gets these big old snot rockets and we have to like pull them out of her nose. It's really disgusting. But, um, uh, so, I mean, it just seems like it is getting a little bit worse. Okay. So that's why I am concerned. Sounds like she's purring right now. She also sounds like a zombie in The Walking Dead, a pterodactyl, and Darth Vader. <laughs> All right. Okay. Ta da! All right, got that. All right, we are just. All right, what else is happening? We got the Georgia game today. Tomorrow, I um, am, oh, let's see here. These are cute. These are like not your normal shenanigans. Channel surfing, not gonna be hangry. Okay, that's never gonna happen. Um, let's throw a little glitter header here to break that up because that is the most important thing happening today. Um, and let's do, I mean, I've got the sub too, but I don't know that I'll need it because I might actually have everything that I need. Let's do some maybe. Um, oh. Let's see here. I wonder, I don't know if this black is going to show. Oh, but you know what will show up? We've worked on. So the, set, the package said, this is really long, guys. I'm sorry. It said works on light and dark surfaces. Uh, the only one that worked on a dark surface was the silver one. The rest of them did not, FYI. So, but from the Dollar, dollar General for $5.50, I uh, am not going to be concerned with that at all. Um because I still consider it a good deal, because they looked really pretty on regular. Um... Okay, that's gonna... Ah. All right, remember how I said I was going to... Uh... All right, so apparently... Yeah, okay, it does, somewhat. It definitely looks better on the black, the blackout paper, or not blackout paper, it was black post-it notes that I was testing it all on. Um, yeah, I was testing everything on these. Um, so, where is, oh yeah. So yeah, that definitely, eh, I don't know, maybe it's about the same. Yeah, it's about the same. From my angle, it doesn't look very bright, but. All right, so we got that. And let's see here. Oh, that's right. I was gonna put cleaning time on this one, but. There we go, we'll go like this. Okay, all right, Um. now let's see here. What What else can we be doing? Um. All right, I know I have a hair appointment. I got a haircut and I feel like, um, I have something for that. And I don't know if it is, it's not with me. It, I know where it's at. Hold on. At least I think I do. Send help. I need to get organized, guys. Um, which I know is not reassuring. 
um, considering you give me money and I send you product. Um, but I know where, aha, I know where the most things are, you know? Here we go. It is from Elizabeth at Tilly Blee Plans. Let's rock with the green. I gotta go get a hair trim. Cause it is getting too long and it looks a little scraggly on the ends. So, I've got that. Uh, there we go, we've got that. And then while I was looking, I also saw these little football girls that I got from her also. There we go. All right. I'm trying to be really good and um, make sure I'm using everything that I have because I love, love, love supporting all my shop friends. Um, and I buy some stuff and then I always forget to use it because, you know, I put it away and organize it somewhat. So there's that. Okay. Um, let's see here. Ugh, Wednesday. I don't even know how to mark that. Um, let's see here. I have no, ugh, no one likes going to funerals, um, at all, there we go, um, so, and it just, um, is breaking my heart because, uh, his daughter just had their first grandbaby, and not to mention he was um, only, he would be 59 this year. So with me being 43, that is definitely not um, that old. So when I was in my 20s, yes, that would have seemed extremely old. But now as I'm 43, I'm like, yeah, that's not that old. Um, that's really, really young. Okay, if you were the glitter headers that I had. Oh, yeah. Oh, shoot. I don't know what just fell, but hopefully it's not anything I'm going to use. Um, something slid off the side of the desk. I'm telling you, I have got to get this desk organized. I got to get my whole office organized. All right, um, so that's 9, 10, 11, 12. Um, I got something on that day too. So, anyways, okay, I feel like I'm not talking very much. I'm sorry, this is just laying down stickers, which, I guess is what everybody's here for. All right. These little glitter pins are so nice. I, I really hope that was on frame because you know that was my goal last week <laughs> was uh, to be on frame um, in 2020. I think that's how the washi goes up is what's making it not look even. I don't know. Or I could just, you know, line it up with the lines that are on here for that exact purpose. But that would be crazy, wouldn't it? That would just be crazy. Crazy. Mm -hmm. Bonnie Tyler is on the radio right now. I think this is throwing me off because I don't like it so close. I'm going to move it down one. There we go. 
All right. Uh, I need to hear what's playing in the background. Okay. Um, oh, I need date dots. And that is in a pile. Cha-ching. Right here. Look at me go. So, oh, I've been reformatting um, all of the monthlies and I have been reformatting the, um, uh, the TBC Nation kit. It's gonna be academic kit because it works for so many different planners. Um, so that is happening. Um, I've been kind of re, not re, been reformatting a little bit the other weekly kits too, but all I'm doing is rearranging some stuff on there and adding more stickers. So it's a win-win, but not changing the price. Whoop, whoop. So, you know, um, all right, let's see here. I have no idea tonight for dinner. Um, we are going to do something easy. I think when Russ comes home, I think I want to just do like chicken and rice bowls. Um, we make them like Chipotle. So I think I'm going to have him do that because that will be easy. And on Tuesday, mainly is always tacos just because I try and cook, you know, once a month. Um... And tacos is the extent of my culinary expertise. Tacos and beef stroganoff. Um, let's see here. What else do we have in the freezer? Um, let, oh, we've got pork chops. We can definitely do those. And we can do the cauliflower bake. We haven't done that in a while. Um, we usually do the... It's pita, pizza, but it's a keto pizza because it's got the cauliflower crust, which we found a brand at Walmart. It's a white box with green labels, and there's two in a pack. And I want to say it's like $9.98 or something. They're really good. I mean, Russ puts them um, on the smoker, and you can't even tell that it is a cauliflower um, pizza. So I think it's phenomenal. Oh, God, guess what? Andrew's coming on Friday. Yeah. Um, so, oh, we're definitely going to do Italian while she's here. Uh, Italian. I can't spell. That is so wrong, but just pretend like it's not, okay? Just pretend like it's not. Um, yeah, I forgot that, um, she is coming in this weekend. And, um, she's, she has Friday off because she had taken it off, but it got, uh, she had women's retreat for her church this weekend and it got canceled. Um, I don't know why she told me, but if I could remember, that would be a miracle. Um, cause we talk about so much. Um, so, um, we are going to do, uh, so she was like, last time she took a day off and she, whatever she was doing got canceled. She tried to get it back from her company and they never credited her PTO time back. So she was like, forget it. I am gonna keep it and just come up there. So that's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So Saturday when she's here, ooh, we're gonna do steak and green beans wrapped in bacon. It's really, really good. Um, it's a recipe that we found when Russ and I were doing um, paleo um, because we were doing CrossFit and stuff. Uh, so what we do is take, and then Sunday's gonna be leftovers. Um, so we take uh, green beans, the steamed green beans, and you cook them, and then you take bacon and you cut it into ha in half or thirds, and you wrap it around the green beans. Um, like in the middle, and then you baste it with a uh, bourbon, um, bourbon glaze, and then you put them in the oven um, and bake them until the bacon is crispy. Um, and they are so 
good. They're so good. Okay. Yeah. That worked out nice. All right. Yay. Okay. Oh, you know what? We need to mark. Oh, you guys totally. I was writing in here. I'm not doing well as far as staying in frame, obviously. Okay. So, I'm so excited. Am I? Yes. Okay. Andrea. And, you know, I love my nephew, and I keep him a lot, and I go to Charleston and see everybody, but sometimes some good old sister time is uh, all that's needed, um, where it's just the two of us, and because I don't have new releases next this weekend, um, I won't be printing and cutting. I'll do some designing, and I will do... Um, um, and we'll play, be up here playing in stickers and all kind of fun stuff. But there's like no, like, because she would come to help me pack orders and everything. And so this is, she's not coming for that. She's just coming to hang out so we can have some good sister time together. So that makes me so happy. All right, um, let's do a green. So happy. All right, cool. Okay. So that is how I'm going to leave this because that is what I know is happening this week. So that's it. That's what's happening. I hope you guys, thanks for sticking around. And there was a lot of, you know, usual squirrel moments and babbling and wandering around. Um, I'll show you what it looks like next week after it's all finished. But I hope you guys have a fantastic day and thank you for subscribing, watching, thumbs up, you know, all the good stuff. Later.